everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to take on the mammoth task of decluttering my wardrobe. As you can see in the background, I've got my little rail that I keep in my kind of office, study room, um, slash dressing room. This is like where I get ready, where I keep all of my clothes and stuff. So I'm gonna be decluttering that. I've also got a set of Ikea drawers that are full to the brim and so like mismatched and muddled up with all of my clothes. And then I've also got a wardrobe. So we're gonna be getting it all out today. I'm literally gonna take all of my clothes, make a huge pile in the middle of this room, and then I'm gonna sit and go through it with you guys. Um, obviously, I'm not gonna show you everything because this video would be super long and I would probably lose the will to live. Hoping to get rid of some bits because I just have too many clothes. I have things that I don't wear. I tend to wear the same things over and over again, and I just want to give them to a better home, whether that's send them to charity shops or I might sell a few things on Depop if there's anything worth selling. Um, so yeah, I'm literally gonna get on with it because this video could be really long. Um, so, wish me luck. So I'm basically just going to go through all of my stuff. So this pair of Joni jeans um, I actually picked up from a charity shop a really long time ago. But they are my only pair of black jeans. So until I invest in a new pair, because these ones are really faded now, um, I will actually keep those. So I'm going to make a pile over there to keep. Next we have these trousers that I actually bought not that long ago for work, um, but they didn't really fit me very well. They're from ASOS. I literally wore them once and then decided that I didn't like them and that they were too big. So I'm going to get rid of those because I'm just not wearing them. Um, I love these trousers. These are from ASOS, like high-waisted baggy trousers. I've then got my smart pair of trousers, which I love. These are super old. They're just from Miss Selfridge and they're just like black smart trousers. So I'm gonna keep those. I've got this pair of jeans, which are from Noisy May on ASOS. They are super, super faded black. And again, I need to get myself a new pair, but I do still wear them. So I am gonna keep those. I'm also gonna keep this, which I bought for work in case I have like a job interview or something. It's just like a cute little white blouse. I've got a black version as well, which was actually from Primark. Um, but I don't really like this. And yeah, so I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm also gonna get rid of this jumper. Now this is such an old jumper from H&M had it for a couple of years um, and I've just put it on like a few times recently and I just really don't like it. I don't feel like it's me anymore so I'm gonna say goodbye to that. I've then got this black jumper which again I bought for work and it's actually like falling apart. It's from Primark. It's in awful condition um, so I'm gonna chuck that. I've got a plain grey Topshop jumper which I'm definitely gonna keep. I've then got this cardigan, which I really want to like, but every time I put it on, I just hate it and it's just not me. So I think it's about time I said goodbye to this. I think I might sell this because it's kind of like fashionable at the moment. I feel like bright colors and cardigans and stuff people are really into and I love it, but it just doesn't look right on me. So I think I might sell that. I'm then also gonna sell this um, Zara hoodie. It's like a little cropped lilac hoodie. And again, I've worn it a few times but it's just not really me i never really feel great when i wear it so i'm gonna sell that got some cute little dresses here this one i'm definitely keeping it's from h&m just a cute little bodycon dress with like dragons on it i wore that so much in the summer i also wore this top a lot which is pretty new from topshop like a little corset black top i've then got this shirt which is so old from Zara but I do actually still quite like it. It's like a cord navy shirt so I'm gonna keep that.
can't quite believe the amount of stuff I have stuffed in those drawers. Um, but anyway, let's get going. I feel like it's quite hard to do some of this because a lot of my clothes are summery clothes and I feel like it's really hard to know what kind of things I'm going to want to wear during the summer. But anyway, we're just going to go with it. A lot of this stuff is like loungewear as well because a lot of it's like joggers and stuff. So um, joggers, keeping those. Actually, two pairs of joggers. I've got this t-shirt which is actually pretty old from Pretty Little Thing but I really like it and I wear it quite a lot so I'm going to keep that. I've got these little shorts that I like to wear. These are from New Look, just little loungy ones. This is in no order so I'm really sorry, it's very random. Um, I've got these pyjama bottoms from Primark. I really love Primark pyjamas, they're like one of my favourites, it's where I tend to get mine all of the time. I'm going to chuck these away now because look how embarrassing this is. These shorts are so old that the toggle has actually broken on them so they can finally go. Oh my gosh, I've just found my favourite trousers, look at these. I can't ever bring myself to throw these away even though I don't really like them anymore and they don't really fit me. They're from Urban Outfitters and they're like stripy trousers and they just remind me of festivals so I can't bring myself to get rid of them. My current favourite pyjamas, um, I think the bottoms are actually in the wash, it's this set that I got for Christmas from ASOS. It's got um, leopard print on it, love them. I've then got this gorgeous top that my friend Jodie made me. The back's come unlaced, so I need to sort that out. But really cute little crop top. I think I posted a picture on my Instagram of this. Um, but yeah, she makes like cute little crochet tops and stuff. So um, obviously I'm going to be keeping that. I've got some little cycling shorts from H&M. They're like little shiny ones, they'll come in handy. I've then got some more lounge shorts, these are ASOS, just grey ones, more pyjamas which I love and I'm going to keep those. Another favourite pair of pyjamas are these ones from H&M, they're like silky pyjamas and they've got a little bit of lace at the bottom, they're really nice. Oh I've got this little top which I picked up from Zara a while ago in the sale, it was literally a few pounds and I thought it was really soft and quite cute so I've got that, I've got another pair of um, Primark pyjamas, these are like green well, bluey green um, set with like little stars on, really soft and comfy. Okay, I think it's time to get rid of this top. This was my favourite top like a few summers ago, but I think it's had its it's had its wear now, so I'm gonna say goodbye to that. I'm also gonna get rid of this top, which was from Topshop a few years ago. It says sunshine on my mind. I've worn it to death and it's just time to go. I've also got a few pairs of these kind of shorts and I think I'm just gonna... I'm going to say goodbye to those. I imagine they won't be in trend next year, I feel. Oh my gosh, this is so old. This is a little crop top from Topshop. Look how small it's turned because I've washed it so many times. That is going. That is definitely going. So I'm finally getting somewhere. This is my keep pile. I still feel like there's too many things in it. So I still might get rid of a few things when I sort of like pack it back into the wardrobe and stuff. And then this pile over here is my getting rid of pile. Excuse all the makeup, really sorry about that. Um, but yeah, these are the bits I think I'm going to be getting rid of. Um, so yeah, now time to put it all away. What I'm planning on doing um, is putting all of my favourite pieces that look good together on the rail and then the rest will go into this wardrobe here and then all of the pyjamas and stuff will go back into these drawers here. So I'm going to start putting my favourite bits on the rail, I think. guys can we just appreciate how creased this shirt is i've got a few shirts like this and every time i wash them they get so creased so i do actually need to get my steamer out and steam it um which maybe i will do once i finish this video actually but for now you're gonna have to deal with it looking absolutely awful sorry about that
I have finished my wardrobe clear out so I thought I'd just show you the after. So this is what my rail looks like. Um, like I mentioned I do need to give everything a good steam. I don't know what Mark is picking up on the camera. So yeah, I've kind of picked out all my favourite little pieces and popped them all along here. So just to go along very, very quickly, we've got a shirt from Zara, hoodie from Zara, a cute little dress from Miss Selfridge, a Goose and Gander jumper, really, really old shirt, another little dress from New Look, um, Zara shirt, really old ASOS suit jacket, ASOS jumper, Zara shirt, Motel Rocks dress, um, Top Shop green jumper, ASOS sauce dress, uh, this is really testing me, monkey um, suit jacket, Urban Outfitters sweatshirt and a ASOS little sweater vest. Then over in the wardrobe, it doesn't look particularly nice but I have got quite a good order going on so I've got like all of my trousers and skirts and shorts down this end, then I've got a couple of tops jumpers and then it just kind of goes to like a few little jackets and shirts and things like that down that end so that's looking much better um if you're wondering what that is that is my wash basket i'm really sorry and then over in my ikea drawers i've got my underwear in the top two so we don't need to look in there um i've then got a drawer with just like plain t-shirts and vests next drawer down is long sleeved tops we've then got all of my colored tops and t-shirts this drawer is pyjama tops and then I've done a separate drawer for pyjama bottoms just because I literally have so many pyjamas. Um, I've then got a drawer for like workout leggings, regular leggings and shorts. Last but not least, I've got my bottom half drawer, so like joggers and loungewear and stuff. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed seeing me declutter my wardrobe. I'm actually planning on filming a similar video but with all my makeup and beauty and skincare items so do let me know if that's something you would be interested in watching please make sure you're subscribed to this channel if you're not and please give the video a huge thumbs up if you did enjoy it make sure you keep your eyes peeled over on my depop because that's where i will be selling some of these lovely bits behind me um so yeah i'll leave that link down below make sure you check that out they won't be up for a little while because i'm literally filming this video and it's going up tomorrow so um yeah it won't be up for a while but do keep your eyes peeled over there because that's where i will be selling any bits thank you so much for watching i hope you're all doing super well and i will see you next time with another video goodbye